How did you get past Sergeant Moo? Huh. Well, you won't fool me so easily, madame. I shall question you later. Nico, am I glad to see you. I managed to grab a couple of photos, but the guy got away. Poor Henri is dead. I know. Why kill him? I've been trying to find out. Turns out the alarm was tampered with. It looks to me like an inside job. So, no ordinary robbery? And no ordinary painting. The priest claims that La Maledizio is evil. I need to get into the office and see what the CCTV has to offer. So, what's the problem? The inspector's watching me like a hawk. I'll never get in without some sort of distraction. I'll see what I can do. Josh? Yeah, Nico? So why do you need to get into the office again? I'm pretty sure the robbery was an inside job, and I think the proof is in the office. So what's stopping you? Super cop over there. What if I create a distraction? You do that, and I will let you have whatever I find. That's a deal, Georges. Somehow, I had to get the inspector away from the office door. I'd never met the gallery owner before, but he sure didn't deserve this. The tomato sauce had splattered on the floor. I spread some of this sauce around with my shoe. It looked a little bit like a blood stain, but it still wasn't right. If I was going to distract the cop, I had to get rid of that gun. No way was I going to clean that up with my bare hands. I scraped up the chewing gum with my press card, hoping the inspector wouldn't notice. Excuse me, Father. Father Simeon, my child. Are you okay, Father? It's a terrible shock, but yes, I'm fine, thank you. Could I ask you some questions about the crime? What kind of questions? I'm a reporter for La Liberté. I suppose it cannot hurt. Please ask away. Why did you come to the gallery today, Father? God brought me here. I saw the poster for the exhibition. I had to come. What do you mean? I knew there was great evil in La Maledictio. It was my duty to confront it. The painter was El Serp, the serpent, don't you see? Evil? So what were you planning on doing here today? I wanted to bear witness to anything that the devil would conjure. Well, I think it was a no-show, Father. Really? A man is dead, Miss Collard. I'd say his work here today is done. That wasn't going to help my story. Did you see anything that might help identify the killer? The devil takes many forms, child. I didn't get a good enough look, I'm afraid. Anything would help. I'm sorry, my dear. My mind was elsewhere. What do you know about Henri? An innocent victim, in so far as any of us are innocent. If he was peddling such blasphemous works as the Elsa painting, then who knows what other sins he was hiding. Father Simeon was making me feel guilty. Priests always did that to me. What do you think about that stain? Is that blood? I think it's just sauce. I wonder if there's a mop anywhere. We are facing death and divine retribution. This is no time for tidying up. 
Father Simeon wasn't making much sense. What can you tell me about the painting? Grotesque and evil. How can a painting be evil? By killing all who come into contact with it. Does that mean we're next? Laugh not at the devil's play, Miss Collard. This is my press card. As I said, I work for La Liberté. Good. Be sure to warn your readers that this painting is evil. Thank you for your time, Father. The priest had nothing useful to offer. Are you Hector Lane, the art critic? Enchanté, madame. And which of the angels are you? I'm Nico Kallar, a reporter. Ah, a fallen angel then, my favorite sort. What can you tell me about the painting that was taken? It was called La Maledicio, an unknown work that only recently surfaced. Who was the artist? A mysterious figure known only as El Serp. Some say he was a student of Picasso. He was good, but not great, and his true identity remains unknown. What can you tell me about the theft? Oh, it was truly awful. What he want to know? Have you spoken to Georges? The American? Yes. He promised to clear up any misunderstandings the police might have about my presence here. Father Simeon says that the painting is evil. The priest is a lunatic. La Maledicio is a painting, and a painting cannot be evil. What can you tell me about Henri's involvement with the gallery? Dear Henri, a shining diamond in the ordure that is the modern art business. He owned the gallery. What will we do without him? Tell me about the shooting, monsieur. No, it all happened so fast. Take your time. What did you see? I can't be sure. Perhaps I could answer your questions over dinner. I'm sorry, monsieur. I'm on a tight deadline. Did you see the thief? I would have tackled him, but he was too quick for me. Did you know that the alarm had been sabotaged? No. How dreadful. I suppose that's why the alarm isn't ringing. Here's my press card. And there was I thinking you were too young and beautiful to be a reporter. Thanks for your help, Monsieur Lane. I wasn't going to get anything useful from Lane. Inspector Nave, do you have a moment? My time is of the essence. Be quick now. Do you want this chewing gum? Madame, I do not take bribes. I suppose this is quite a complex case, Inspector. It is a robbery gone bad. Nothing more, nothing less. Surely there's a bit more to it than that. Please abstain from baseless conjecture, Madame. The victim's body paints a simple picture, more reliable than any witness statement. Consider the impact of the bullet, and note the concomitant lack of blood. A casual homicide, nothing more. Don't you find it odd that the thief chose that one particular painting? Life is full of odd things, madame. Fingerless gloves, white dog poo-poo, nasal hair. I prefer to concern myself with murder. Did you see the alarm was sabotaged? I have interrogated the crime scene, madame. I am fully aware of the disabled security. I prefer biological evidence to the merely circumstantial. Body parts, blood, important things. Don't you think the disabled alarm is highly suspicious, though? 
the forensic team will be along shortly. Voice your concerns to them. Do not bother me with this circumstantial flifflaff. Why don't you check out the security camera footage? Madame, that is not my area of expertise. It is the body which concerns me. But the CCTV footage is evidence. It could help identify the killer. Correction, madame. It is but an indicator. The only true evidence is bodily fluid. Unless you know something I don't, then please leave me be. The only evidence Inspector Nave seemed to appreciate involved gore. What do you think about the American, Georges? He is deeply suspicious. Have you seen the stain on the floor over there? It looks like blood. Indeed. How very curious. I must investigate immediately, before one of these idiots steps in it. Hmm. Interesting. Maybe it is time to employ the machine. Okay, Georges. That should distract him for a while. Nice work, Nico. I'll let you know what I find in the office. <laughs>